Hi team, welcome to our weekly review. Um, this is the first trade sent by our trader Smart Money. It was a buy limit order on Euro GBP. This was the, um, the instruction, this was the indication. Um, it says you can also wait for the breakout of the structure on the five minute chart before entering. So that was the instruction, it was a buy. Um, and at, actually this is this is what happened let's let's take a look it was a buy position in this area so let's see if we got the five minute uh, breakout as you can see this was the last high then price broke this low this was my last high then but the level got removed so in this case there, were, there was no trade we should have followed the instruction and price ended up removing the whole level in the end and then uh, he sent another one on euro CHF but this one is uh, still active our order still has not been failed yet right here at the one zero three three eighty two now those are the entries shared by smart money um, this, these are the entries that I share during uh, the week. These were the ones that I share during the week. Um, this one is this one was the first one on Euro Aussie, USD CAD. Um, I'll go over this one in a, in a second because this was this one was very funny, and this one that we had to cancel uh, because the level did not retrace. On Bitcoin, we were uh, we were selling. Uh, we were looking for a sell position right at this area because this area is the one that broke the structure, but the price did not retrace, and uh, Bitcoin ended up dropping from this level around the 36k support. I guess. Let me let me check. Yes, this is this is the entry, uh, but unfortunately, the price didn't retrace to the level so it just dropped to the 35k support um, then there um, there was another one on Euro Aussie this is the other one in Euro Aussie um, we had a 2.219 risk reward this was the entry price broke the structure then it reversed to the level and then it um, the price hit level um, the TP1, which was around this supply level in the five minute time frame, and then price reversed and uh, stopped us out at break even. But the TP1 was hit, and uh, we had a we had this uh, return to 19 risk reward ratio with a two with a 32 almost 33 pips. Um, on this position, then this was this this was the one that I really regret. <laughs> I really regret with what I did with this one. Uh, this position was a buy on dollar cat. All right, as you can see, price started to change structure right in the four hour demand level, and our target was hit in less than a second because there was some macroeconomic events coming out and uh, as per FTMO rules I'm not allowed to trade this uh, this type of um, events unfortunately so I had to remove my entry and I recommended removing the entry also to the team yeah it's up to the traders it's up to our members if they if they remove the entries or if they keep the entries according to their trading plans but I decided to remove the entry because of that because um, yeah there were some some macroeconomic events and I'm not allowed to keep this entry so I decided to also recommend uh, the people to remove it so this was the entry we were looking on the USD cat and this is what happened take a look so this is what the price did in less than a second take a look here this was our this was our entry right here this was our entry price retraced to our entry level and then boom it hit our target pretty fast as I said less than a second 
right there. But I decided to remove it, so I didn't take it. Uh, I don't know if um, if our members uh, remove this entry also, or if they keep it. If they kept the entry, well, they had to take profit in less than one second. It was, it was crazy. It was a crazy entry, and uh, yeah, that was it. That was it. Was pretty dry. It was a dry week. It was a dry week, but it was good. We ended up in profit. We also share more more analysis and more setups. I've been trading the New York session all, uh, using only Euro Dollar, and uh, we ended up with the stop loss, with the break even, and with one winning. And also, our smart money trader share a couple of entries there. Let me let me show you those. So these were the all um, the other trades and setups uh, we share in our Discord. Um, as you can see, this was on 26 January 26, a sell position on Euro Dollar. Here we were in profit already, and our TP target was hit. So that was that was the the entries we share during the week. It was a pretty week, decent week. We ended up in profit, uh, but yeah, it was a dry week. Few setups, few entries, but the ones we share ended up paying pretty good. So that was it for the week. I hope you like this video. I hope you enjoy it. Keep in mind that we will share weekly forecast on Mondays. So I'll see you on Monday, guys. Have a nice weekend. Take care.